Hi friends, welcome to Sri Sai IT Hub. In this video of Core Java Programming, we are going to discuss the following topic. Pitwise operator, right shift with zero fill. Right shift with zero fill in Java program. So let us start with bitwise operators, right shift with zero fill. So right shift with zero fill is used with three greater than symbol. Okay, it is three greater than symbol. So coming to bitwise operators, they will perform operations on bit levels of a given number or operand or value. Bit levels means binary representation of a given number which is zeros and ones. So these operators mainly works on byte, short, int, long because only integers can be converted into binary values. Okay and bit levels means binary representation of given integer. For example, if we take binary integer 10, its 8 bit representation is 00001010. If we take 18, its binary representation is 0001010. So this is 8 bit representation or 1 byte of data. If we take short, it will be 16 bit. If we take integer, it will be 32 bit and if we take long it will be 64 bit representation right so coming to the bitwise right shift with zero fill how this operator will work for us okay so this operator it will shift the bit levels of a given number towards right side by given number of times and empty bits are replaced with zeros for both positive numbers and negative numbers. So for negative numbers also, the empty bits are replaced with zeros. Okay. So when negative number, empty bits are replaced with zeros, it will convert into a positive number. Okay. So 10, right shift of 2 with 0 fill. Shifts bit levels of 10 on the right side by 2 times with 0 fill means empty bits on the left side will be replaced with zeros so negative okay right shift with 0 fill shifts bit levels of minus 11 on the right side by 2 times with okay with 1 fill okay so here left mode left most bits which are left empty are replaced with ones but if we take something like right shift with zero fill so shifts bit levels of minus 11 on right side by two times with zero fills zero fill it will fill the empty bits with zero Whereas in normal right shift, so this is normal right shift, it will replace with 1. So negative number will be negative number only. So here, negative number will be negative number only. Okay. But in this case, okay, here, negative number becomes positive number it becomes positive number so let us try to demonstrate this with a small example a 10 b is equals to minus 11 which is a negative number so 10 double zero double zero one zero zero one zero one zero so count one values 8 plus 2 wherever there is one count its corresponding values 8 plus 2 10 so let us perform right shift with zero fill on positive number 10 right shift with zero fill of 2 so let us take the 
डबल जीरो डबल जीरो वन जीरो वन जीरो ओके सो लेट अस शिफ्टेड टुवर्ड्स राइट साइड बाय टू टाइम्स ओके सो व्हेन वी शिफ्ट दिस टुवर्ड्स राइट साइड बाय टू टाइम्स टू बिट्स विल बी मूविंग आउट ऑफ ऑर्डर दिस टू बिट्स ओके इग्नोर देम एंड द लेफ्ट मोस्ट बिट्स वी हैव टू रिप्लेस विथ जीरोस they should be replaced with zeros okay so bits which are moving out of range whether it is 8 bit 16 bit or 32 bit should be ignored and left out empty bits should be replaced with zero okay so the answer for this is 2 because we have only one here in this place whose corresponding value is 2 right so similarly let us take a negative number so this is important for us minus 11 which is complement of 10 so its binary representation is 11110101 so let us try to shift this towards right side by two times okay right so right uh, right side by two times so what is happening here so the if we see here two bits are moving out of order just ignore them okay which are moving out of order and the left most bits left side bits are empty so <clears throat> replace them with zeros instead of ones okay so when you replace them with zeros the negative number becomes positive number okay so let us try to calculate the value here which is so this is 128 64 so 32 plus 16 okay so 32 plus 16 plus 8 plus 4 plus 1 okay so let us try to do this in a small calculation so 32 plus 16 plus 8 plus 4 plus 1 okay So what is the answer for this? So thirty-two sixteen is forty-eight. Okay, right. So forty-eight plus eight, fifty-six. Fifty-six plus four, sixty. So the answer is sixty-one. But we'll get a big number here. Why we'll get a big number? First, we'll execute the program and then let us understand. If it is a eight-bit byte number 61 is the correct answer but internally these numbers are by default integer integer means 32 bits so you will get a very big number okay right so here empty bits are replaced with zeros but not with ones even though it is a negative number so for many negative numbers most significant bit is 1 if most significant bit is 1 then it is a negative number so it does not retain negative sign it does not retain the negative sign by replacing with zeros instead of ones so hence negative number becomes positive number okay right so let us try to understand this okay with a small program bit wise right shift zero fill example so let us take a new page so this will be our main class so initially we'll write the comments program to demo bitwise right shift zero fill operator so use this comments so write the main method public static void main string of orcs right so let us try to save this in our working directory bitwise right shift zero fill example 1 dot java okay so we'll take the same examples int a is equals to 10 int b is equals to minus 11 so simply print system dot out dot print ln a right shift with zero fill two times and then b 
right shift with zero fill two times okay so open the command prompt okay right go to your working directory compile the program java c bitwise right shift with zero fill example one dot java compile it and then run it so we are getting and let us try to I will take this example minus 11 okay instead of 61 why is that we are getting a very big number okay right so here internally minus 11 is an integer integer means it is a 32 bit number so 32 bit number means will have a very big number here so this is just 8 bit but internally it is 32 bit so 32 bit number goes like this right so we'll have double one double one double one double one eight bits next eight bits next eight bits so this is the exact number which is minus 11 for 32 bit integer okay so this number when it is shifted towards right side by two times what happens exactly internally let us try to demonstrate that okay the same number we'll take it like this so two numbers will be moving out of order okay right so this is the whole number actually right so this whole number let us copy it and then shift it towards right side by two times okay right so if you shift it towards right side by two times right so here only two bits are left empty so these are replaced with zeros okay and the last two bits will be moving out of order we can ignore them okay and if we calculate the value for this number okay this big number okay automatically we'll get this number one zero seven three seven four four one eight two one okay so this is a very big number so this is one two four eight sixteen thirty two one uh sixty four 128 next we'll have 256 512 1024 so on it will become a very big number and that number will be this number 1073741418 so this is how we are supposed to work with bitwise operator right shift with zero fill in java program and this is specially designed for negative numbers negative numbers will be converted into positive numbers thank you for watching this video do like and share this video and also subscribe to the youtube channel sri sai it hub have a nice day